Hi, this is a short video on how to do remote debugging using GDB on Eclipse CDT. So here I have two virtual machines. This is the development PC and this is the IP address. And this is the other virtual machine. So I'm using L Ubuntu. So this is the remote. The IP address is 192.168.1.2. So I will start my Eclipse. So I am using uh, the Eclipse Neon 3 CDT because I'm having issues with um, Eclipse Oxygen. Okay. First, what I need to do is to establish an SSH connection to this remote uh, virtual machine. Okay. So I'll do that by going to show view other remote so remote systems. Okay, and right click new connection. So choose Linux. So the IP address of the remote machine. Okay, next. SSH files, next. Next, SSH files, finish. Okay, so. Okay, so now I can see my my directory. So this is the remote directory. So I'll be creating a a GDB folder here using this folder GDB. Okay. So as you can see, the GDB was created. So I'll be deploying my application to this folder. Right click. So now I'll be creating a Hello World application. So Hello World Linux GCC. Hello Linux. Next. Next. Then I'll just do a build. Build project. Okay, so far so good. So I'll deploy I'll be deploying this application to the remote machine. Click debug us debug configuration. And double click C C plus plus remote application. Then here let's create a new connection. SSH. Okay. Then the IP address of the remote machine. One that two. So This is for Eclipse. Okay, so far so good. Can remove the absolute file though. So I'll be I'll be specifying the directory that I created earlier. Okay, Okay, so far so good. Let's go GDB. So nothing is here. So I'll, de I'll be deploying my application to this folder. Okay, you can then go to arguments. Okay, and that's just your, a random port. Okay, so let's try this. Okay. 
looking good. Okay, so there's the breakpoint. So let's do a step over. Yeah, so it works. So run. Stop. Okay. So as you see, the Hello Linux is already here. Okay, so let's try to run it. Yeah. So yeah, so there it is.